Well, when I go back and watch videos and I made the videos, I realize I have forgotten a lot of the great points in the videos. And I made the videos. This is kind of bizarre. But, you know, go back to topics that, that you're working on and watch a, you know, video, a video scroll through, go forward. You, know, you have access to the Ocean Foundations, all those videos, and they're here on Facebook. And it will spark different ideas if you're feeling like a little repetitive about stuff. Um, or you can ask me you know, here in the group, you know, what videos you know, would you recommend, all of that. Because it really is funny how you know, we're watching, we have these huge, like we, I'll say, you know, I can watch something, have a huge insight. And then oddly, two months later, I can't even remember the insight. And I'll have the same insight again as though it were the first time. So I don't know what that's about. It's like Groundhog Day in my head. Um, but I think that's true for, for all of us in some weird way, that, that things don't stick um, unless you know, they, we repeat, repeat, repeat until it really gets into, I don't know, what part of our brain that we have access to. So definitely go back and watch different videos again and watch these coaching videos because, again, nobody's got a unique problem. Um, these are all just typical, typical problems. So let's see. And they're all, you know, examples of like ocean principles applied to different um, performance behavior problems. So the one other thing I want to say is if any of you um, had trouble, you know, going through all the Ocean Foundation videos because of things being compulsory and them not being checked off when you actually watched them, let me know and I'm going to go back and I have to hand change them all out, but I'm going to make none of them compulsory so that you don't have to, you know, watch everyone all the way through um, to watch the future ones because I was just kind of scrolling through and seeing that some members have not gotten very far into foundations. And I want to make sure at this point that you could go ahead and jump forward and watch some online coaching and jump around, that you're not limited to, you have to watch every video before you get to progress to where we're at right now. Um, because everybody's working at their own pace. And like I've said before, I've gone through Ocean Foundations three times now. And each time I go through, I have a deeper understanding of why this works. And, you know, this isn't just for dogs. There, like, I was turned on to a video by this guy named Schiller, um, this Australian guy, who's doing, like, he even uses the same language that I'm using in Ocean, but he's doing it with horses. And it's, it's remarkably similar. So this, this, I, there is something to this that, you know, I didn't invent this. I'm just presenting it in the way that I present it, but that, that really takes our relationships and our communication with our dogs to a whole new level. And it's, it takes a lot of the complexity out that, yes, we need to know the behavioral sciences and how animals learn and animals, including how people learn that there, we need to know that, but that this thing that we call intuition, that it's, you know, the sensory experiences that aren't in our intellectual consciousness when we're interacting with our dogs, I think ocean helps you connect with that and to trust these feelings we have and that we can notice that moment we have the feeling and then notice what our dog is doing and make a connection that normally we wouldn't be having if we're very involved in you know, making sure, you know, I click at the right moment and making sure my dog has, you know, feet in exactly the right spot, that type of things. 